Hey, good afternoon, guys. Today we're going to be taking a tour of the Rivalo 242. The Rivalo 242 is made in Georgia. It's an American made, beautiful, beautiful boat. Uh, with a draft, uh, we're running about 20 inches on a fully loaded boat. It'll get you where you need to go. So let's go ahead and get started on the tour. We'll start at the back here, the rear of the boat. As you can see, she's powered by a single 300 horsepower Yamaha motor. This is a beautiful bulletproof four-stroke engine, three-blade prop, and she's ready to go. You can also see this 242 is equipped with trim tabs. This will keep you on a smooth ride and a level plane. Uh, we got your traditional tie-down straps, transom saver, uh, and that's about it for the rear of the boat. Nothing too exciting. It does have a nice pull-out swing ladder here. As you can see, you just pull it out, drop her down, and pull your legs out and you're in and out of the boat, nice and easy, right? Beautiful design by Rivalo. Uh, you know, American engineering there, and that's one of the key features. So we'll work our way into the boat now. Uh, we use a step ladder when you're outside, outside of the water, it's better on the boat. Uh, we'll go ahead and start here. Here you have your fresh water fill up. You have your uh, fresh water uh, pump out if you need it. You also have raw water wash down hose here. So uh, in the event you're catching all your red snapper, you get blood in the boat, whatever you need to do, you have your wall, wall, uh, water wash down there. So if you wanted to go ahead and take a step up and follow me, it does have a swim door here. All your electronics, battery, everything, uh, switches are easy to be accessed. You don't have to climb in the boat to access that. And uh, step right up. Go ahead and start at the rear of the boat. Great spot for fishing, great spot for hanging out. To your left here, you have a cooler for all your drinks, frozen bait, whatever you might want there. Has a nice drain straight out to the back. Uh, we have a nice clear top live well here. Holds all your croaker, your minnows, your mullets, whatever you want to put in there. Recirculating live well, very nice feature. We also have uh, two rod holders to the rear, as you can see which is a unique feature on Rabalo is they double as rod holders. So if you want to do your trolling, feel free to slap in a pin, you know, pin 500 or your uh, jacuzzi full of cold drink, you'll be good to go. As you can see on the rails here, we also have uh, two more rod holders, rear facing. So in the event you need to do trolling, you have that option there. And that'll take care of the back platform. So you can see you have a nice gunnel which also doubles into a flip up, fold down seat for your lady passengers and to uh, have a smooth and comfortable ride. As you can see a grown man can sit here comfortably, lay down, take a nap, uh, do whatever they need to do there. Another unique feature about this is that you flip that up if you need it to access your batteries, your pumps, you have a nice easy access uh, to all your equipment there. Really nice feature by Rabalo uh, to have that. You have your standard igloo. Um, I don't recommend this. This will hold a 65 quart cooler. Igloo is, uh, you know, your ice will melt fairly quick. You have a flip up rail, locks in that igloo nice and tight. We'll move forward to the seat here, the captain's seat. You see you have your four rod holders as well as four up above on the hard top T-top. And we'll work our way into the seat here. So you have a nice captain's seat with flip-up bolsters for standing driving as well as sitting driving. Uh, these are a you know a nice feature to give you that relaxing comfortability as you're taking your ride out on the water. Uh, we'll go ahead and take a look at the the console here. As you can see, we have not installed the electronics yet. You do some research there, but you do have all your key buttons on the left and the right. Uh, these power all your electronics. Comes fully equipped with a Clarion stereo. Very nice feature. And uh, also you have your, trim, your uh, trim power tabs here. Uh, one other unique feature by Rabalo here is that it's fly-by wire. So there's no cables between your steering wheel and your motor, as well as your throttle and your motor, which makes for a feather light uh, engagement and throttle. So it's a really nice feature. It also, uh, you can set this, this motor to whatever RPMs you want. You can limit it out, you can set it for trolling. 
It's a really nice feature uh, when you're out and about on the water. We also have auxiliary plugs and a USB for charging up your phone, cigarette lighters, dry storage up top, lockable, securable, as well as here in the console, as you can see. Uh, really nice footrests for when you're just cruising, hanging out on the boat, and the T-top provides ample shade for those sitting. I'd also like to point your attention to the spreader lights. So when you're out doing night fishing, hanging out, partying, whatever you want to do, you do have your rear lights here, as well as lights under the rails so that you can see your toes and whatever you need to do at night. I do want to point out here, this is a tow bar. So when you are reeling in your red snapper, you can, as you can see, it'll hold a grown man. Your tow bar is a really unique feature that'll allow you to really put in and dig into those fish. It's really nice. And as well as rod holders, below on both sides and your speakers as well let's go ahead and move our way to the front so Rebolo did a really nice design here in the front lounge area you have cushion seating this goes all the way around you also have an optional platform which is hidden in your storage compartment we'll get to that in a minute but what this does the seating it sure does provide a comfortable and smooth ride as you're taking on the waves and enjoying the sights and wherever body of water that you're in. Solid handrail, American-made construction, uh, solid backrests that are removable. So if you're into serious fishing or you're out with the family, it's well versatile there. Uh, right here, you have a cooler or a fish box, however you want to meet your knees. Of course, it has its drains. Very nice feature. Same thing on the other side, flip the cushion. Boom, you're accessing your cold drink or you're launching your keeper fish. All right, in the front is this another live well or it can be used as a cooler as well. Recirculating water again, very nice feature. Uh, you have your anchor in the front, uh, two anchor cleats, pull up cleats, your navigational lights, and it also has built in shade posts that you can connect them and make an entire shade up here. Uh, down in the floor, comes ready with your cast net bucket so you'll put your cast net in here all your wet gear throw it in the bottom and you're good to go nice locking latches uh, as well as tension latches so these are nice a nice feature Rebolo put on here you don't have to worry about the slam it's just a nice tension and easy shut there that covers the front of the boat and again this you know you can put your platform cushions down or a standing platform for fishing very nice feature by Rebalo. Let's take us into the head here. Another nice feature, Rebalo outfitted this with a uh, power toilet. Welcome to use if you're a woman, a man shall not use this toilet. It does come with a window, as you can see there, uh, in the event you need to spend ample time down there. Okay, well that covers the front of the boat. I do want to point out on the side, you have an easy access to your uh, lures and your tackle box here very nice feature uh, pull up cleats all the way around the boat easy access fuel system and I believe that's it uh, for more information feel free to like the link below and ensure that you subscribe and uh, we'll be showing more reviews of this 242 as we get it out and show the performance of the boat. Um, but I just appreciate y'all's time and look forward to seeing you soon. Have a good day.